century has always been trapped amid the eternal conflict. Depending on what you do next, your life.
tell me, did they rejoice? No, they do not want you. It is done. It all ends with you. No. We made a choice. And that they can never forgive. No matter what you tell yourself or who you sacrifice. Silence. Is their judgment? But, but I set things right. What more would you have me do? Tell me, please. Tell me. The heavens do not. Speak to you anymore. Heavens, protect me! No, you belong in hell. Mephisto, Diablo, Bale. The ruination of Sanctuary is imminent. And yet you doubt. Only zealots and fools are completely certain, Mother. If we are to be saved, it will be by your hand. I have not come to save, but to empower. In my shadow, the strong will oppose the might of hell itself. Let the weak fend for themselves. And Arya lives. The horror dream die. Whatever the cost. Whatever the cost.
shameful. Our father has granted you a path to salvation. <laughs> and yet, you stray from it at every opportunity. You drink and gamble. You covet and steal. Shameful. Sin is their birthright. <gasps> My children. The Lords of Hell are coming to devour our world. Salvation lies not in the light, but in you. The faith has taught you to deny your heart's desire and turned you into a prisoner within yourself. Break the chains and discover who you were meant to be. Break the chains and be beautiful in sin. child into this world. Way opens. Blood shows. This doesn't make any sense. Blood. Blood. Blood is the key. B blood is the key. Ah, what? I need two of you. No. Go. I'll hold them. Go. So. It says the, the blood of the willing goes. Ugh. You gotta be kidding me! Ah, it worked! We have to help him! He's dead. 
dead already. Well, cheer up. Gold splits better three ways instead of four. Must be hidden here somewhere. Read this. But by three they come, by three thy way opens, by the blood of them. Willing. Hail, hail the cre the creator. Ha! Oh, hail the daughter of. Oh no, 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 no! What about the coin? What's it say? This is forbidden. This is a summoning. I cannot speak. This Don't lie to me. We came here for treasure. What is this place? I I, I don't know. <sighs> Maybe, maybe it's a temple, or, or a tomb, or... It's a gate. There is no light here. You came to the darkness for knowledge. Yes. And all the knowledge you seek is here. Surrender. Speak the words. Call her home. By three, they come. By three, thy way opens. By the blood of the willing, we call thee home.
Hail. Sanctuary was never meant for humankind. It was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. A secretive group called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was and Sanctuary's ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. This is the story of their downfall. Sometimes, our paths in life are set to collide. We just don't know it. Whether it is by accident or fate's hand, there is nothing we can do about it. The wanderer lost in the storm, fed the blood of Lilith, saved by a lone monk. Different lives and incidents drawn together, by what? Destiny? Or some greater power pulling the strings? I did not know. But at the time, I thought I had the chance to protect humanity from the daughter of hatred. The Wanderer's connection to her gave me hope. <laughs> 
Imagine that. Are you Vigo? I was sent... <coughs> I know what I saw. She had horns like a beast. Strode right past where you stand. To think my mother's trapped in there with her. You let my mother through, sir. Shouldn't you be responsible for her safety? But, uh, we have soldiers stationed inside. You should be worried about them, too. <clears throat> Maybe you can help me. Forgive this intrusion, but... Tell me what you need. I must traverse the Black Lake, and that cannot be done without your blessing. If I've learned anything during my time here, it is that what we're looking for, and what we need, are rarely the same thing. I once thought I could find an end to this war, but there has been no resolution, only more pain. Everything I've done has pulled me further from home, from the place I need to be. This world we made was born from the impossible, and yet, like its creators, it rots from the inside. I... I don't... Lilith has entered the ancient city. With your blessing, I can pursue her. Your kind are weak, and this world has been wasted on the crusades of the unworthy. I can stop her. Hmm. This audience is concluded. I don't know if you would have chosen to stand beside me in this new world, Rathma. But I would have saved your place just the same. And now, all that you might have been has been stolen from me.
be. I know who you are. And I know you, Talon. Old, tired, each day a struggle to live up to your own legacy. What do you want with me? Astaroth. <laughs> She's dead. Astaroth cannot die. Not by your hand. What have you done with him? Away, demon. I deny you. You have grown so frail. I can make you the hero you were. Return to the darkness from whence you came. I said away! Mighty Astaroth, the charred duke himself, confined to a cage. What a pity. Daughter of hatred. I have an offer. You will grant me safe passage to a place I am no longer welcome. <sighs> In exchange, I will give you freedom. And more. <laughs> Donan's progeny. His pride and joy. <laughs> Your retribution. If you give me what I want. <laughs> evils were reforming. Hell was coming. But Elias was not the answer to anyone's prayers. If you want to take the measure of someone, you judge them by their deeds, not their words. Simple as that. Elias preached of saving the world while standing atop a mountain of corpses. Then there was the Wanderer. Everything Elias was not. Tainted by Lilith's blood and yet able to resist her corruption. That was what I witnessed in the Wanderer's deeds. And that was when I started to think that perhaps together, we could keep the evil at bay.
my father's essence is reforming. How do you know? I feel it. Like a thousand old wounds ripped open again. He is still weak. Vulnerable. I must strike before he can resist. Make his power yours. The other lords will. orders from you in years, Lorit. I see no reason to start now. You should have come to me instead of the cathedral. I would have shown up for you. Shared your burden. I know. And perhaps things would have gone differently with Scott's claim. And with your Was it enough? Will he think it was enough? Thank you. 
pray that worked. Come on. Lilith will hunt us down. I must end it. I'll find Lorath. We'll make this right. And we'll wait for you at the chapel. This better not be the last time I see you. Understand? I spent a lot of time learning this code, so I hope you remember how to read it, Lorath. Because you are the last Horatrim now. My mother would have wanted me to stay with you. She believed the Horadrim had all the answers. I don't know if she'd recognize this person I'm becoming. That's 
what I hold on to. Because there is so much further to go. Your imperfection gave me hope. And we will need it to face what comes next. To face him and his brothers. I don't know how much time I have, but there has to be a better answer. And I have to find it. Alone. I know he'll want to go with me. But people have already died because I was not careful enough. I can't risk you too. If I've misjudged, the world is going to need you to survive and clean up the mistakes I leave behind. I know you don't want to hear this, but you don't get to quit. Not again. If everything works out as I am hoping, we will never see each other again. We should be getting you home. But there's still work to be done. If these translations are correct, <laughs> the powers of hell could already be on the move. The world must be told of the coming darkness. You do believe me, don't you, Leah? It has begun. Leave it, Uncle. It's not important. you know about sacrifice. Tyrion, the ancient law of the High Heaven strictly forbids us from interfering with the mortal world. Yet you have done so, brazenly. All I am guilty of, Imperius, is bringing justice while you hide, cowering behind your throne. Silence! 
now answer for your transgressions. Judge me. I am justice itself. We were meant for more than this. To protect the innocent. But if our precious laws bind you all to inaction, then I will no longer stand as your brother. Will find the stone wherever you 
choose to hide it. Then, at long last, Asmodan <laughs> shall reign as the prime evil. champion, the Nephilim, rose to confront the darkness that we, in our pride, would not face. place among you once again but this time as a mortal
Since justice has been met this day, I will now stand as wisdom. On behalf of those who risked all to save us. Forevermore, we shall stand together, angels and men, in the light of this glorious new dawn. Service here is finished, and you should all. So, Marius, at last I find you. Tyrion, yes. Yes, now, now I recognize you. you. I should have known you'd travel in the skies. They're, they're always watching. I've been searching for you for a long time, Marius. I was rather beginning to think you didn't want to be found. 
Oh, forgive me, Tyrael, please. It, it wasn't my fault. Not your fault? Tell me, Malleus, how was it not your fault? The Wanderer. Yes, it was... It was the Wanderer. My days at the Rogue Citadel seemed so long ago. I sought refuge from my memories in the company of other outcasts high in the mountains past the Eastern Gate. When I dreamt, the memories would return. Memories of the monastery and the evil which it claimed. Dreams, memories. I couldn't tell the difference anymore. Could he found me here? How could this broken shell of a man, barely able to carry the weight of his own sword, be the burning terror which drove me to hide here? have demons of his own he struggled to contain <laughs> convinced that I was truly mad. The terror, the destruction, the, the evil I witnessed. How else could I explain them? Were these the demons from my dream or were they born within the wonder? Beckoned. 
I had to follow him. And from that moment, we traveled together east. Always. We traveled east, over the mountains and into the vast deserts of broken lands. As the days passed, my companion told me of himself, that he had once been a great warrior, and that a dark and secret burden now weighed heavily upon him. We traveled for an eternity across that barren wasteland. How long ago? I couldn't say. And always, a dark cloud seemed to follow us just over the horizon. Finally, the journey ended. We climbed the last bridge. There below us lay our destination. The shining jewel looped the lane with a great sea beyond. We made camp that last night. Perhaps it was the warm desert wind or the sound of the ocean, but for the first time in many weeks, I slept. However, the dreams returned, but these were clearly not my own. I beheld the vision of a great man, the mage, Talrasha. You were there too, Tyrion. I remember seeing you in my dream. His brethren had cornered a great demon, Baal, Lord of Destruction, who had been set loose upon the world. They attempted to imprison the demon within a sacred stone. Their attempts failed. Talrasha selflessly volunteered to contain the demon within himself, completing the prison. He instructed his brethren to bind him within the tomb, buried under the sand, there to wrestle with the demon for all eternity. set out with the dawn. The next morning, we walked over the hill toward Lutkulain. I had no idea then of the horrors that were in store for me there. My companion drew in the dank, cold air of the tomb. To strengthen him. I stood in the doorway between light and dark. What was left of my sanity implored me not to enter. But that voice was just a whisper now. As we worked our way down deeper and deeper into the crypt, I began to see a change in my companion. He seemed to be gaining strength. I could hardly see in the gloom, but my companion seemed to know the way. We came at last to a great hall. He had been losing what was left of his humanity.
He moved with demonic speed, and then... And then you appeared. Stop! The beast contained herein shall not be set free, not even by you. It is you told me, Tyriel. I found the temple of the Zakarum. In the deepest recesses of the temple, I found a dark gathering. My companion, the Wanderer, Talrasha, and a great evil who could only be the Lord of Hatred himself, Mephisto. I heard a voice that, like a thousand needles in my heart. My brothers, at long last we stand reunited. The infernal age has been prepared, and the time of our final victory is at hand. Let the way to hell be You 
Give it to me, Marius. Take it. Take it, take it. I'm glad this is finally over, Tyrion. Look what the stone has done to me. <laughs> You haven't failed, old man. You've done exactly as you were meant to do. However, I am not the Archangel Tyriel. Well, no. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> you have done well. Now I think you shall have your reward. What have I done to deserve
Ariel. The gates of Sacheron have stood for eons beyond remembrance, and you shall not breach them now. Remove your foul demons from our lands. We stand on the side of light. You shall not be allowed to reach Mount Ariat. And that which you seek will not be yours. Enough! Enough! I shall take your position into consideration. Well, it seems your terms are not acceptable. <laughs> General Radan, Praetor Rikard, Luna Princess Rani. Willful traitors, all. Thy kind are all of a piece. Villagers, emboldened by the flame of ambition. Have it writ upon thy meager grave. Felled by King Morgoth, last of all kings.
I dreamt for so long. My flesh was dull gold, and my blood rotted. Corpse after corpse left in my wake. As I awaited his return. Heed my words. I am Melania, Blade of Mikola. And I have never known defeat. Mikola. You must abide alone a while. Welcome, honored guest, to the birthplace of our dynasty. And hard didst thou fight, tarnished warrior, spurned by the grace of gold. Be assured the Elden Ring resteth close at hand. Alas, I am returned. To be granted audience once more. Upon my name as Godfrey, the first Elden Lord.
I've given thee courtesy enough. Just horror loo. by the flame of ambition.